Hey guys, my name is Tim Schmoyer, and it's Thursday. Time to do some Q&A with you guys, answering whatever questions you have. If you have something that you would like me to address and talk about in an upcoming Thursday, leave a comment below, or even better yet, check in the description text below this video, and you can see how you can submit your video question directly to me, and I can have your face right here, and we can talk. It'd be awesome. Here's this week's question. Tags are probably the biggest mystery to me, and I'm guessing for many other creators. More in-depth look would be greatly appreciated. Smiley face. Sure, we can talk about tags for a little bit. Basically, all they are is telling YouTube, here's some keywords that relate to my video. Now, there's two things, two different types of keywords that you want to keep in mind when you're tagging your videos, and that is first, you want to start off with your most specific keywords first. The keywords, or tags in this case, that you put towards the beginning will carry more weight in the algorithm than those you put at the end. So, you want to start off with very specific keywords first and then get to more general keywords like towards the end. So for example, let's say you did a video about your Big Mac at McDonald's. <laughs> Some tags would probably be Big Mac, McDonald's, fast food, those are like specific type of examples, but then more general ones that you put towards the end would be like restaurants, uh, food, um, just by itself, like fast food would be like in brackets, you know, like put quotes around it or just type it and hit enter as a phrase. Maybe the word like eating or eating out or dining, those would be more general. Does that make sense? I typically try to make my titles, my description text, and my tags all kind of reflect the same keywords. So I'm really honing in on some of those specific things that I want people to find my video for when they search for those things on YouTube or Google. So often I'll try to craft a title that contains my most significant tags in the beginning of the title because again keywords that are close to the beginning of your title carry more weight than those towards the end of your title so I try to craft my titles with those keywords in mind but also in a way that is just normal English and is enticing for subscribers to click through when they see it. How many tags should you have? Well that kind of depends on your content sometimes I just have five, six, seven, eight tags. Other videos, I have like 32 tags. It all just kind of depends on your content and what you're talking about and how specific or generic it might be. Another little tip is to make sure you include misspellings of your tags as well. Like for example, over at Real SEO is R-E-E-L-S-E-O, but a lot of people end up searching for R-E-A-L. So we'll also include tags that have R-E-A-L-S-E-O with as with a space and also as one word without a space because people are searching for a number of different ways. How do you know what people are searching for to find you? Well, that's actually a whole different video, but real simply, just go to your YouTube analytics, look under traffic sources, and you'll start seeing what people are searching for for you there. Let me give you a resource to check out that gives you more information and help regarding titles and tags and description text and metadata in general, and that is the YouTube Creators Playbook, but there's a specific page in that book that talks about this, and I am actually going to link to it directly. You can find the link in the description text of this video. Click it. It'll take you straight to that section where you can read more about all this and their advice for tags. And if you guys have any advice for this person and others who might be watching this video later, please leave that in the comments below. Let's all help each other out. And if this is your first time hanging out, welcome. We'd love to have you subscribe. Every Thursday we do some Q&A, interactive stuff like this. Just answering the questions that you guys have about online video, audience development, YouTube, SEO in this case. On Tuesdays we take a look at online video news and what that means for us who are video creators. And on Wednesdays, we do some YouTube tips, advice, and other things, all to help you guys communicate your message on YouTube and get it to the people who really need to hear it. So I hope this helps. Subscribe, and I will see you guys again next week. Bye.